What do you want from me, lady? Some sort of commitment, damn it. You can't check in and out of my life like a hotel room. I have feelings, just in case you're too blind to see. Sorry, I just couldn't get away. And when he suggested we have dinner, you could have at least told me. Yes, I. I guess you're sorry for that too. And the fact that your phone was conveniently off. My boss comes into town twice in a year. I didn't want to seem distracted. Come on, baby. It's just. Hello? Hi, sir. Laura? Where are you? Laura? I'm at the police station. 
Police station. Have you been arrested? Yeah. Robert and I had a fight. So they arrested both of you? No. <sighs> Laura, you didn't... Can you be here early? I'm coming right away. No, no. There's no point. Just be here early, okay? We're going to court. Laura. <laughs> It's beautiful. Germany. Came in my last consignment. Here. Thank you. You should have it. Oh, Laura, I can't. <laughs> but you didn't need to come in the middle of the night. It's okay. I need it for the company. <laughs> well, come on. Shameful. I know. Why did you do it? Why can't they just be a little respectful? I grew up with a father who beat my mother and treated her like garbage. I guess I'm just determined never to be that woman. Or oh, that man. You are angry and you're taking it out on your boyfriends. Laura? Hey, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I want to stop. Then go and see the therapist like the judge ordered. I'm not sick. You go to jail. If you don't go. <sighs> Do you know where Robert is? No. But he has a restraining order against you. I liked him, you know. Yeah. At least the sex was good. Someone good will come along. Hmm? No man, sir. There's hardly any good one out there. Hmm. If you like you like you should have put a ring on it. Good afternoon, my princess. 
I don't really feel princessy today. Well, you look good. I have to. I work here. No, you own here. And all the others you'll be owning soon. William, I'm not in the mood for expansion talk. Forget expansion. <sighs> Finally. Something. Think revolution. War. Transformation. Change for womanhood. Think. Satisfaction guaranteed. Sex shop. In Ghana? No, Laura, think big. Africa. Africa is not ready for this. And yet every girl slash woman owns one of this. I don't. You should. It's the new handbag for women. It's pretty, it vibrates, and it gives you pleasure. It's silicone. It's reliable. I sell furniture. So? You put the furniture in the sex shop. Who would ever think that someone will spend like $5,000 on a chair? It's a revolution. Hey, you. You should try it. Maybe you should try it. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Seriously. I'm so sorry. I can only imagine how you're feeling. She wants to sue. I understand. And that you should. I can recommend no. some. No. She wants you. You know? Mm -hmm. Leave us. This is the worst thing that can happen to any woman, especially with your line of work. But I need you to understand that once you pursue this, you open up to more scrutiny. People will judge you harshly. The skills are still not tilted in our favor. He lied to me. He's a liar. But that's not what we're going to focus on. It's every ounce of dignity he took from you. You're not taking my case, are you? No. I'm a criminal lawyer, and it's a bit... Below you? Actually, I was about to say it's a bit above me. I need to tell you something. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. I called Oliver. I told him I was suing. From now on, you let your lawyers do the talking on your behalf, OK? OK. I loved him. I know. I know. It's the ones we love that hurt us the most. you called your lawyer. Look, I'm glad you did. My life is, what am I even saying? I don't have a life, at least not anymore. <sighs> it's 
So does it get easier after 11 months? Not when your husband's killer has still not been convicted. Not when you relive the most horrible moment of your yeah. life every night in your yeah. sleep. No. It doesn't get easier at all. Look, I never really do friends or any of that stuff, but we could do this once in a while. What, drink? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. So what do you think of a sex shop? Sorry, what? I am thinking of opening a sex shop. To sell what? Wait. This is not what I think it is, is it? Mm -hmm. It's yours, by the way. Try it. Let me know if there's a market out there. <laughs> You get a life. A statement? Oliver is a liar and we are suing him for every password he doesn't have. Stupid fool. I swear I'm going to teach these idiots a lesson. I swear to God. Okay. All right. Hello? No, this is not her. Gina, enough. Enough. Just. No, 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 Tilly, we need to say something. No, your boss says not to say anything. To Oliver, perhaps, but these press people Gina. are talking. You work in a law office. You know these things don't just go away because you want them to. Just, just leave it, please. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. I can't believe I was so naive. Come on, it's not your fault. You trusted the fool. Yeah. You know what? My mom always said that, never trust a man because, one, they either move, die, or betray you, and then you never see them again. Gina, I don't think I understood that. I don't know, I don't really understand that either, but I think there's a lesson in there somewhere. <laughs> Gina, what's this? Gina, is that what I think it is? Mm. Where, where are you going? To start my work whilst you try finishing yours. No, no, please, please. I'm almost there. You know, I can't believe you had sex in my bed. Ah, uh, did you have sex in my bed? We we did it on the wall. You know, we were like two lizards. <laughs> Don't try and be cute. I thought we had a deal. No sex on my bed. Ah, uh, hello, Gina. No, this is not hair. Yes. Okay. Okay, thank you. Who's that? That was a producer from Hollywood. Mm hmm Tilly, he wants to offer you a role. Mm-hmm. 